Hi everyone and thank you so much for joining in today. I hope that you are having a magical day. I wanted to give a quick little review over the new Rainbow High Series 3, Cheryl Myers. Um, so she actually has been kind of hard to find with decent lips. Um, there, there seems to be a few variants that you can find with um, like a really dark liner. There's also uh, some kind of shimmer and there's also a neutral liner. Um, I have found that Walmarts and maybe Amazons, I've not ordered any from Amazon, but Walmarts typically have more of those darker lipped um, variants where it's just that thin dark line and sometimes it can be skewed. So that's, I would kind of steer clear from Walmarts if you're looking for Miss Cheryl. Um, definitely get her from Target if you can find her. They have the better variants. Um, there's a lot less of the harsh line. Um, you can't really see, let's see. You can see her lips are super neutral, super natural, um, and she also has a softer look as well. I noticed um, the ones with the darker um, lip liner, they have a more intense eye makeup as well. I did take a photo. Um, I'll probably, I may end up posting it at the end of the video for you to see it. Um, if you guys want to see it, just let me know and I can post it in something else or do a comparison or something. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get her open. On the back of the box, it's just your standard series three. It's got Miss Daria, Georgia, Cheryl, you've got Daphne, Gabriella, and Emmy. Um, then on the box, you've got her variant as well. Um, but she comes with two outfits. These are on sale right now at Target for $24.99. Um, so definitely, if you've got the Target app, just get that barcode at the bottom, bring it up, and let them scan it because you're gonna save a little bit of money. Also, um, they're doing a special where you can get 25% off. So if you're in a town where you can find that giant Maya, go ahead and grab her because this holiday season, I'm very confident she's gonna be the hardest thing to find. So let me get her out. <laughs> so here is Miss Cheryl. She's really beautiful. And she lost an earring. So there's her earring. Let me get her out really quick before I go <laughs> give a full on review of her. Um, but she is really stunning. I love the like blatant ripoff of Clueless. That was so bold of them. And even like with her name, like it's it's so spot on. And even down to the the fact that she has brown eyes. Like I, I think Alicia Silverstone also has um, brown eyes. Um, and if you don't know who that is, she is the mom from the Babysitters Club. Or she also played Cher in Clueless. If you grew up in the movies, or just like that movie in general. I'm not that lucky. Here we go. Okay, here she is. This is how she comes straight out the box. She's got a few little plastic danglies hanging off of her. Let's see if we can get them off. And let's also put her earrings back on. So much better. There we go. So here she is. She's so stunning. I love this new face mold. I think it's so cute. It kind of had, it took a second for it to grow on me um, just because I feel like the first face mold was really like Disney-esque and it had so much personality, but this one is really unique, especially with this specific aesthetic. Um, my favorite part is honestly this little shoe and, and thigh high um, white sock situation. I know Bella's were really cute and so I'm glad I have another pair because I keep losing them. Um, I think that this is actually two pieces and just joking, I lied, this is just one piece. So this skirt with the extra ruffle, I think it's just one piece. It looks like she's got an undershirt, a nice bell, a cute little jacket in a full plaid situation. There is her earrings and her cute little socks that are, let's see, let's see if it'll focus, there you go. So her socks are a really cute white with the pastel yellow shoe, and I think it has little pearls on it as well with little bows. Um, but let me get her face a little bit closer so you can see her specific lips. So you can see that hers are actually fairly even, which is really, really, really hard to find right now. Um, usually one of the lips are a little bit higher than the other, um, like as far as the sides, or it has that really harsh line. So I'm really lucky to have found her, but if you do find a good one, go ahead and grab her so you can save yourself a little bit of time on customization. I did actually get her with a customization in mind, so I'll go over that in just a second. So let me go ahead and grab her second outfit. You guys know what stands look like. Oh, 
Oh, cute, it's a headband. So let's see. So she comes with that cute little sweater, a nice like white shirt, this little skirt. You know, of, of everything, this skirt is my least favorite part, but it actually kind of goes with this shirt. So I can't dog on that actually right now. I'm gonna wait until later to do that. Um, she also has a cute headband. I'm never gonna actually use it, but it is super adorable. What does her shirt say? I think it just says rainbow and lower, lowercase cursive for, shout out to cursive for, for those of you guys who remember that. And let's see what else we got. Her other shoes, they're okay. Um, they're very simple. They're very like, honestly, kind of rainbow high vibes. I'm not sure that I quite understand them, but they're they're basic and they'll totally work. Um, as far as her her um, stand and her hanger, let's see what we got. It's actually really cute. I think it's very similar to Sunny's. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's pretty much the same as Sunny's. Uh, just simple yellow, but I do want to go over the reason that I, I chose her today um, specifically and not just because like Everything aligned and her lips were perfect and there was a sale at Target But I chose her because I Want to do a quick little swap with some eyes I've been wanting some people have been asking for me to do a video of the way that I do my eye swaps and I'd love to do that, but unfortunately, I think I already swapped everybody I've got. Um, I may have a few extras, but I, I'd rather do this mold because they apparently have a different um, peg situation inside of their eye socket. So I'm gonna find out what is going on with that on camera with you guys, showing you how I was able to do five and 25 minutes with the other one. The first one takes a second, but once you get it going, it goes quickly. So I'm gonna end up giving her Daria's eyes so she'll have a nice little seafoam and pink moment. And then I'm gonna give her Cheryl's eyes so she'll have brown. And that is for a customization that's coming up. So with her with the brown eyes, I'm gonna change her hair. I'm not gonna give away too, too much, but, um, I'm, she's going to be under the sea inspired, so, hmm, I don't know. Um, it may have to do with uh, my favorite girl group who was recently split up. Uh, one's going to be playing somebody special in the Disney franchise. So I'm going to make something um, unique for that. I don't think, I'm, I'm nervous about the dolls they're going to make. Let me just go out and say it. I'm nervous about the dolls they're going to make for the live action Little Mermaid. Halle Bailey is so beautiful but I'm nervous because Hasbro has the licensing for Disney princesses. So I'm gonna make a few versions. I'm gonna start off with the Rainbow High version. I'm gonna do a Barbie version, then I'm gonna do a Disney store sculpt mold situation version as well. I just don't like Hasbro personally, but they're great. So yeah, this is Miss, uh, this is Miss Cheryl Myers. Let me know what you guys think about her. Um, stay tuned for future things that are coming up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But thank you guys so much for watching. Magical Matthias out.